A flock of offshore seagulls signals food in the water, a school of tuna, or maybe a fresh kill. With expedition time running out, the team grabs any opportunity to explore the situation. We are setting out to do something that no one has ever done. We have to capture and lift mature white sharks out of the water, hopefully giant females, to unlock the mysteries of their two-year migrations. You have room from here, though. No? Oh, yeah. With their larger chase boats scouting in another area, Chris is forced to take the rubber zodiac out to see what the birds are after. Chris keeps his eyes on the flock. It's just gonna, we don't want to lose it, huh? We don't want to break up on us. Don't mind to the side if he comes down. Okay. All right, quick flyby. Whatever it is, it may be attracting what they're after. It doesn't take them long to find the action and a fresh kill. Look, there's a carcass right there. There's a Oh, that's yeah, a shark. Shark. shark! Wow, that's a big shark, man. OK, everybody, be clear. That was big. It's an elephant seal. Oh, my god. That is unbelievable. That looks like a fresh kill. Be careful in case that white shark decides to come up and eat that thing. disturb the shark's meal, but it's a sign more sharks are in the area, so they move a short distance from the kill and drop a line, hoping to catch a different shark. I've been coming here for 10 years, never seen a white shark eat anything here, ever. It's the first time, it's my best trip of my life ever here, Chris, it's got, it is. Suddenly, the crew gets more than it bargained for. Other boats approach and one has no idea what it's coasted into. Everybody be careful. Be very careful. The crew's very aware they are on an inflatable with sharp objects below. Directly underneath us. Well, if we get bit right now, this is going to be a bad scene, man. Oh, look out, she's going to take a bite of us. sitting on the boat, sitting on the ship, just kind of, you know, just another day, catch and releasing and tagging white sharks, you know, just what everyone does. And all of a sudden, I'm told, get on this boat and go out. OK, so I hop on this boat, we get out there. And the shark isn't just feeding on this carcass, it's feeding on everything, including the inflatable that we're in. And to see the shark come up, just kind of loll up, come up, and just want to touch it, and, and just Get a little sen sensory of what that prop is. And all I can hear in the back is, stick it in his face. Put it in his face. In her nose, dude. Stick it in her face. Stick it in her face. And I'm going, do you realize where my hand is? Are you, <laughs> what are you, what do you want me to put in the face? You want me to lose an arm? <laughs>